What's up guys? Today's video is on the best travel mugs in 2022. Through extensive research and testing, I've put together a list of options that'll meet the needs of different types of buyers. So whether it's price performance or its particular use, we've got you covered. For more information on the products, I've included links in the description box down below, which are updated for the best prices. Like the video, comment, and don't forget to subscribe. Let's get started. At number 9. Swell Insulated Tumbler, 18 ounce. Best Slick Designs. Swell boasts that its tumblers are triple walled, but we're not convinced that has much real world benefit over a normal double walled tumbler. What really sets the Swell apart are its designs. There are 12 finishes, from plain colors and bare stainless steel to elaborate patterns, such as blue marble and faux wood. There's a slide open lid so you don't have to pop it off every time you want a swig of coffee. At number 8. Snow Peak Double Wall Insulated Cup, 450 milliliters, for camping. When traveling, I want to pack light. Snow Peak's gorgeous insulated titanium camp mug is less than 4 inches tall, weighs only 4.2 ounces, and has fold-away handles to make it even smaller. Its 450 milliliter capacity equates to slightly more than 15 fluid ounces. As someone who finds washing mugs to be an interminable hassle, this is the easiest one to travel with, just refill, rinse, and carabiner it to the outside of your bag. You can also buy a lid separately. At number 7. Stanley PMI Classic Vacuum Pint, 16 ounce bottle opener. Stanley's Vacuum Pint includes a press-on lid with a deeply pebbled exterior that's reminiscent of classic flasks, and also hard hats and construction sites. Although it's billed as a 16-ounce pint, Stanley has added a few extra ounces to accommodate foam, or splashing hot coffee, and the lid comes with a slide and metal bottle opener if you like to go immediately from work to happy hour. At number 6. Yeti Rambler Colster, for cans. Tumblers and travel mugs are generally designed for you to pour your chosen beverage into, but what if you just want to slam a can in there? That's where the Rambler Colster comes in. This was particularly useful when I was out and about, drinking a canned soda or beer, and had no nearby recycling bin to toss the empty can into. The insulator's lip sits below the rim of the can, so it doesn't interfere with drinking. It fits standard 12 fluid ounce beverage cans and bottles. At number 5. Fellow Carter, 16 ounce, for coffee purists. Instead of a tiny sippy hole, the Carter screw-on cap reveals a wide tumbler that lets you breathe in your coffee's aromas as you drink. The opening is 69 mm wide, so you can use most manual coffee brewers, such as an AeroPress or Hario pour over, directly on it. That's too wide for many cars cup holders, but it's plenty stable, and you won't have to worry about tipping it over on a desk. My average sized hands had no issues, but some buyers with smaller hands say it's difficult or uncomfortable to hold. The interior is ceramic coated, so you don't get any metallic flavors, and the thin metal lip is curved like a Cabernet glass. Its textured matte exterior coating is tough and held up as well as the mighty Hydro Flask's coating. It was completely leak-proof. You'll have no concerns throwing it into your laptop bag completely full. At number 4. Zojirushi Stainless Steel Mug, 16 ounce, hottest for longest. Zojirushi's classic 16 ounce travel mug is a favorite around these parts. The stainless steel interior is BPA-free and has a wide mouth opening to accommodate ice cubes. The lid locks to avoid accidental spillage, and I, Adrienne, have accidentally left hot tea in it for 18 hours and found it still hot when I cautiously open it again. It's also small enough to fit in my jacket pocket on chilly morning walks. It's not my preferred mug for daily use, simply because the lid has three separate parts, a mouthpiece, a gasket, and a lid, that are deeply ridged and hard to clean. I also need a bottle brush to wash the interior. At number 3. Keep Cup Long Play, 12 ounce a paper cup replacement. The long play is greater than the sum of its parts. Its double-walled, insulated version is meant to replicate and replace paper coffee shop cups. It's fun to drink out of. Many other tumblers lid openings are blocky or mash your nose, but the keep cup is ergonomically on point. It's not the best for road trips, nor the best for keeping a ton of coffee hot for hours, but I highly recommend the long play if all you want is a reusable cup to cut down on single-use waste and keep your drink warm long enough for you to actually drink it. That said, it's dribbly. I wouldn't have to write an obituary for my laptop if the long play tipped over next to it, but I'd probably vault over my own mother to quickly pick it up. And while the interior and lip are glass, no metallic off tastes here, the exterior shell below the rubber grip is plastic. 
At number 2. Contigo Lux Auto Seal, 16 ounce, best for road trips. I drive old cars without cup holders, and I, Matt, wouldn't trust my seats and carpet to most mugs, but the Lux Auto Seal is an exception. What makes the Contigo automatic is a button on the side of the lid that opens the sip and hole. There's a lock to prevent the button from opening the hole too. With or without the lock activated, the Contigo never leaked a single drop. Of all the tumblers and bottles I've tested, this is the easiest to reach down and quickly use one-handed. You don't want to mess with latches while you're piloting a wheeled missile down the road. Some buyers have complained that the metal lid gets too hot. But I filled up the Lux Auto Seal with some absolutely scorching, molten coffee, and the lid barely even got lukewarm, so consider that myth busted. At number 1. Clean Canteen TK Wide Insulated Mug, 16 ounce, Best Travel Mug. Narrow openings are fine for water, in my opinion, but for hot beverages I like having a wider gap so I can take a big gulp. You're less likely to burn your mouth on hot drinks when you can slurp, too. The TK Wide's cafe cap is like drinking from a regular to-go coffee cup, rather than a water bottle. All the colors have matte powder coated finishes, which are more scratch resistant than the brand smooth powder coated finishes. That said, I haven't found them to be as tough as Hydro Flask's powder coating, see below, and the uncoated stainless steel ring on the bottom of the mug is pretty easy to scuff up. Thanks for watching, for more details, follow the links given below in the description section, and if you are new here please subscribe to our channel, and hit the bell icon.